So welcome back uh, to my latest series that I have of my CCR Media project. Um, today is the last episode of it and in that, in this episode, we will do like a little presentation uh, and go through everything. Uh, and the question that I would be answering uh, would be... Uh, so today I will talk about my CCR question, which is, uh, which is how did you integrate technologies like software and hardware uh, slash online in this uh, project? Um, well, this is a very good question that I am about to answer and uh, share my experience with you guys of what I learned uh, during this project using these softwares and hardware. So uh, moving on. Um, coming to the uh, software part, um, well, the mostly the softwares that I used is uh, Photoshop and Illustrator. Um, then if we talk about the um, uh, online platforms such as like YouTube, WhatsApp, Gmail and the Google Docs and files, everything. As you guys can see, I have um, put all the pictures of the apps and the softwares. Uh, so coming to the um, softwares, the first day I will talk about the softwares that I used. Well, um, using them, uh, well, how hard it was. Uh, it was pretty hard for me uh, because I never used Photoshop in my life. Uh, you know, like a lot, like I haven't used, I have seen people using it even in my family too. And, uh, you know, any other places, but like, I haven't used it on my own. Or like, you know, like I've seen videos of it and but I haven't used it on my own. So using it was very hard for me because uh, to be honest, uh, I was not familiar with the with the software. Um, because uh, I never used it. So using it was not an easy thing because first of all, the laptop used to crash all the time, which was very annoying for me because I used to work and I had so much other work to do and it used to crash again and again. Then I I was making these mock-ups which couldn't fit in this. So I was trying to do that. Um, so it was just really hard for me to use that. But at the end, I took some help from YouTube and took some help from my teacher. And to be honest, I'm just really glad that I it was it was a great opportunity for me well I'm gonna say that I use these softwares that really helped me uh giving me a new skill that I could use in my life um like I can now make anything I want on the photoshop if I need I don't I don't need to ask anyone else to make it for me I can do it I can make anything on illustrator although I'm not really familiar with the illustrator but like I do know the good the bezel and you know everything but anyways moving on um it wasn't easy for me of course uh but uh i slowly slowly learned it uh from youtube and my teacher and i'm really glad that you know i did this as you guys can see i made the production uh logo for um i made these mock-ups um i made a poster also as you guys can see uh we and we also use these um google Docs for these. Uh, anyway, so you guys can see these. Uh, I have made. I, I have. I have made these on my own. Um, so it was not an easy task, but I'm glad that I did it, and it turned out to be a very uh, great uh, thing. So I'm really glad about that. That I learned something new out of it, and uh, uh, yeah. So it was a great thing to do, and I enjoyed. I enjoyed it a lot. So moving on um, to the hardware. Uh, well, for hardware, we used uh, my friend's uh, Canon uh, EOS 200D. And for the lights, uh, which I brought, uh, it was the RGB portable lights that I had. And I brought also Uniport. Uh, Uniport was for the most stable uh, stable shots so I used it um, because in some shots we needed some sta stability so for that we used this um, Unipod and for the RGB lights we used it for the background light and the uh, for the character for you know uh, for the uh, uh, for 
for for for to show the emotions and to have a good lighting so it really helped us because we didn't had a lot of sunlight so using these lights were really helpful uh, as it really helped us in the shoot and the camera the camera was really good although we were not happy about it but this is what we got we had a tight budget so uh, i think we we worked with it and plus as i was the cameraman i had to use youtube and like other platforms to learn how to uh, take shots and how to be familiar with the camera and how to use it how to do this how to take uh, shot from this angle and that angle so it really helped me especially youtube and other platforms that really helped me educate my you know i i did educate myself and it, i got i got really familiar with the uh, with the uh, camera and the lights and the angles and the shots so it was really helpful for me too as you guys can see the next slide it would be the equipment the, this is the camera that we use this is the unipod and these are the lights these these are the actual lights that we used so the, these three things were really helpful because it, they really helped us and i learned so much from it um anyways uh, coming to our uh, online uh, platforms well i mostly used um, youtube instagram whatsapp and gmail um so for uh, youtube of course i used it for my ccr questions i used it to learn how to take shots um how to be familiar with the camera how to have a good lighting how to uh, how to do some of the work uh, i learned from uh, youtube the if i needed some help in the photoshop illustrator of course i asked my teachers too and she helped me so much but like you know if she was not present i i took help from that so basically and the reason that we use instagram it was because we we did like our informal uh surveys so for that i had some followers so i post posted stories so we used instagram for that and for other promotions too for whatsapp we did it for our basic communication with my partner we discussed our project and everything so that's what we used our instagram for uh and uh, for gmail we usually used it for sending projects and sending um rookie report and like this report everything uh, screenplay and everything we use that for our uh, we use gmail for that um as you can guys can see the on the next slide these are some of the behind the scene as you guys can see me and my friend are using the camera uh, and the um, unipod and you guys can see in this picture i'm using the camera taking the shot of the character um so it was although to sum it up uh it was a really great experience because i learned so much so much from the technology from the softwares to the hardware to the online platforms everything i learned so much about you know like photoshop illustrator uh how to use a camera how to how to have a good lighting how to take a stable shot how to take shots from what kind of angles to 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 the smallest to the biggest things i learned from uh, this project and it was really helpful because i learned uh, so much so much from this project and it was really helpful for me um and i'm really glad that i had the opportunity to create something like that and to learn something like that um uh, so basically um so basically i used just these softwares and these hardwares to help me uh, improve my project and to help me make my project uh, and present it to the people and to, to present it to the world so i did used a lot of uh, technologies and everything so it was really helpful uh, experience and uh, i'm really glad that it was it was a great opportunity for me to use to do that so i think um, I think that is it for today. Uh these are some of the things uh that I used during my project. Um again it was really helpful because it made made it uh, it made everything possible. So I hope you guys enjoyed this small session of me talking about what really made this project uh, uh the project that it is right now and what really made, you know, help me in it um and what kind of uh softwares and uh, uh, technology uh, that 
uh, I used in it. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Uh, take care. Allah Take care. Bye bye.